Hi, my name's Matt Kavanagh, and I'm proud to be part of the admissions team here at LCI Melbourne. This simply means I'm here to help out people who wish to explore study options with us. Today, I'm going to give you a quick tour of our great campus, pointing out some of the studios, spaces and facilities available to our students. LCI Melbourne covers design areas as diverse as graphic and digital design, filmmaking and photography, visual arts, interior design, fashion and costume design, and communication design. We encourage our students to produce ambitious work that develops skills across one or more of these areas. When we get to the studios of these areas, I'll throw across to the talented and friendly coordinators of each section so you can hear a little bit about what they do. There's a lot to see, so let's start. So, we're here in the lobby. On our right, you'll see the wonderful mural by Smug, a leading international street artist. As soon as you walk into the lobby, you'll get a feel for the building and the community inside. Everything's very open with great natural light. The Foy and Gibson building, which houses our campus, was long ago a textile mill. And if you look closely, you can see the interesting mix of the 165 year old structure and the beautiful work done in the last few years to renovate it into three floors of classrooms, creative studios and galleries. The gallery is on your left as soon as you walk in and visible to passers-by through the many windows. There's always something interesting going on down here. We've had catwalk shows, bands, visiting artists have exhibited here, our own teachers showcase their work, and our students all have multiple opportunities to exhibit here. Here is our gallery director, Michael Peck. Michael is a globally renowned visual artist and curator. He's an Archibald Prize finalist and the winner of the NGV Trustees Award. Galleries from Berlin to San Francisco, Los Angeles to Sydney and New York to Hong Kong have all showcased his works. Michael works closely with our students, providing insight and guidance through his deep understanding of the arts industry. Hi, Michael. Thanks, Matt. Welcome to our gallery. This is where we showcase and experience the best that artists and designers create. We host exhibitions for students, academics and alumni, as well as local and international acclaimed artists and designers. We've shown work from Milan, Amsterdam, New York and Los Angeles, as well as collaborating with the Melbourne Fashion Festival and the National Gallery of Victoria. This is an exciting time for art and design, and we are proud to have such a great space to discuss and debate its relevance in the world today. The exhibition you see now was created and curated by our own visual arts students. It shows some of the diverse mediums and ideas that our students explore. It also demonstrates our focus to help students develop their own style and identity as artists and designers. Adjacent to the gallery is the Cyclorama. The Cyclorama is a space that's tailor-made for studio photography. You'll see the wall and floor are joined with a gentle curve and the lights are balanced so that any photos taken in here appear that the subject matter is just on a flat, white background. This lets you dress the space any way you want and layer and process digitally to your heart's content. Even if you don't come on board as a filmmaking and photography student, you'll have access to these resources to learn the skills involved and ensure that your folio pieces are beautifully shot. Max Amner is our coordinator for film and photography. Before coming to LCI Melbourne, Max spearheaded new web developments and media campaigns in the UK and disrupted the European advertising market. Max's focus in education is to utilise all forms of design techniques and digital technologies in order to create solutions that suit the modern design industry. Hi Max. Hello Matt. In film and photography, we focus on the contemporary evolution of visual content creation. Each design lab builds on a working knowledge of how to tell stories and deliver messages with an eye for elegant production value. Film and photography at LCI Melbourne focus on the future trends in lens-based media production and challenges students to integrate traditional image capturing skills with cutting-edge digital production, including augmented reality, screencasting and two- and three-dimensional animated compositions. At LCI Melbourne, you will learn to collaborate with other design disciplines, so you will learn to apply your skills in film photography to work with creative teams. We will equip you with the essential skills to begin a successful career in an ever-connected world. So, up the stairs to level one. On our left is the student support desk. While the campus is large, we keep the student and class numbers fairly small. This means that we have the ability to lend wonderful support to our students, both as individuals and as artists. If you ever need anything, stop past here for a friendly chat. The campus is decked out with multiple computer labs. 
We have recent model Macs here, all of which have full licenses to the entire Adobe suite, so there'll never be a time when our students are stuck waiting for a computer. No matter what you study, we'll ensure you leave with a strong grasp of the industry standard software for the design industry. Whether you're looking to be a heavily digital artist or keep to a more traditional medium, we want our graduates to have all the tools they need for success. Here we are in the foyer. Standing here, you can see all three floors and you get a feel for how open and light filled the space is. All of the studios have glass fronts and that's a purposeful decision as no matter what major you study, we want all of our students to not be restricting their work or their interests to their major alone. You can always see what's happening in each of the studios as there's no reason that you, as perhaps a visual artist or a fashion designer, might not take inspiration from a different area such as interior design or graphic design. Speaking of graphic design, allow me to introduce you to Dr. Barry Spencer. He's a legibilitator, speculator, type designer and doctor. And while the word legibilitator is his own made up title, it does draw attention to the fact that he's a very innovative and curious designer and educator. How are you Barry? Thanks Matt, I'm doing well. Welcome to the Graphic and Digital Design Major. Here we focus on translating messages, ideas, concepts, promotion, problems and a range of other things into visual communication and design. Graphic and Digital Design has the ability to make complicated ideas or problems more understandable and make everyday mundane or less interesting things more visually appealing and evocative. Through learning and engaging with software such as the Adobe Creative Suite, you can explore a wide range of diverse specialties or areas from visual identity, branding, packaging, type design, typography, layout and poster, publication design, through to web and app design, animation, illustration and information design. As you can see, there's a bunch of places that graphic and digital design can take you, so come and give it a go. The visual arts end of the building comes in a few sections. We have the teaching area and that leads to the visual arts pods. Each pod is a workspace that's assigned to an individual student to be used throughout their studies. No need to pack up your work each night or try to transport it home and bring it back. Just walk in, pick up your brush, pencils or sculpting materials and pick up where you left off. The final element to the visual arts area is this large open studio that hosts a mix of activities. If you want an open space with brilliant natural light for a photo shoot, a painting, sculpture or a showcase, this room will allow you to work without needing to rein in the size or ambition of your creations. Here, I'll throw to Michelle Mancio to explore a little deeper. She's a champion of experimental art, having created exquisite global projects for the internationally renowned Future Academy, Metronome Press, Yellow Brick, Kinematics and contributes to Melbourne Writing Collective STUM. Michelle, what can you tell us about visual arts at LCI? Hello, welcome to Visual Art. Our visual art major aims to develop your unique arts practice. You can work in any medium, any style and in any approach. Our aim is to get you doing the best version of it. Our teachers are experienced practicing artists and will mentor you through workshops, demonstrations and lectures. We cover drawing, painting, printmaking, sculpture, installation, textiles, video, writing, performance, and everything in between. We help you engage with the art industry, exhibition practices, and theory through gallery visits and talks, internships, and your own experience in organizing shows. We want you to think independently and develop a successful arts practice. It is a really exciting time to be an artist and this is the perfect place to start the journey. The interior design room is equally great with its natural light and open spaces. Here we have equipment and instruction that will let you explore designs for domestic spaces but goes beyond that into any project requiring design for a built environment. If you're looking at styling for photo shoots, doing a physical art installation piece, perhaps staging a film shoot or a piece of a stage, or styling an event or gallery show, we have everything you need here to support you in producing wonderful spaces. Let me now introduce you to Petrina Turner, one of our truly brilliant interior design teachers. Petrina is the designer, stylist and maker behind multidisciplinary practice Petrina Turner Designs. As well as being a not-so-secret tap dancer, Petrina believes in creating designs with exceptional detail, integrity, joy, and a little of the unexpected. She's a contributor to interior media publications, she often speaks at design events, and she's an incredibly talented and passionate design educator. Hi Petrina. 
Thanks, Matt. Welcome to our fabulous Interior Design Lab. Here, you will learn to conceptualize, develop, and create engaging and dynamic spaces with a focus on responsible design. You will develop an understanding of clients' needs, both residential and commercial. We'll assist you in space planning, detailing, and creation of interiors with a focus on storytelling and human-centered design. You'll investigate styles and trends and use cutting edge technology to produce a professional portfolio that represents your style. You will work in a real life collaborative design studio setting and be given space to explore, develop, create and present your design concepts, execute technical drawings and curate your materials choices using our fully stocked sample library. We can't wait to show you around. The fashion and costume design area comprises of a large double studio, which caters for students working in fashion and costume of all sorts. Everything from streetwear to high-end fashion through to costume for screen, stage and events can be produced here. The studio is beautifully equipped with two large cutting and measuring tables for pattern making, whereas the main studio offers both domestic and industrial sewing machines, buttonhole, button sole, baby locker, over locker, blind hem, manual kick press for eyelets and studs, and more. Let me now introduce you to Jane Parker. We're honoured to have Jane as our Head of Fashion. She's a fashion legend and Australian Fashion Hall of Fame recipient, a designer who creates a quintessential Australian style with a passion for quality and excellent design. Jane worked alongside her brother Stephen Bennett to build the iconic Australian brand Country Road. Hello and welcome to one of the best equipped design studios I've ever worked in. Here, in this naturally lit studio, you will work side by side with an experienced team of educators. Our goal is to nurture, develop and guide your talents into real world design outcomes. We encourage you to discover, observe, test and reflect. To build a war chest of knowledge to express your own point of view. We equip you with skills to craft a form, balance a proportion and apply harmony in colour and texture to your designs. Our trade is fashion and costume. Our passion is to share our extensive and up-to-date knowledge with you. Come join us. Thank you, Jane. Our fashion students really do make amazing work. Here's a video from our 2019 graduate, Virginia Anzella. Thanks for joining us on this virtual tour. One of the privileges of working at admissions is seeing the art and design of upcoming artists. So give us a call and arrange a personal tour, show us the sorts of work you've been doing, and we'd be delighted to discuss your work and talk you through what our program could offer you as an individual artist. Skills that build on your current strengths, but also new ones that help forge new creative and professional skills to propel you forward into new and exciting opportunities. If this appeals to you, please don't be shy to contact us. LCI Melbourne is a supportive creative environment and by calling or coming in as a guest I guarantee that you'll leave with some exciting new ideas about your current work and some really great inspiration for future prospects that will propel you forwards. Hope to see you soon. Best of luck with your creative work and don't forget we'd love you to share it with us.